weird lines of colour. I don't really understand what I'm looking at, but it looks fantastic. What a beautiful evening. Welcome back everybody to another episode of Minecraft Farming Valley. I hope that you're still enjoying this series. It feels so good.
mine then, so we can start going down and finding some stuff. I mean, we're not going to be doing that today. Today we're doing some logging, but I just wanted to smarten things up and just have this set so you guys know the mine that we're doing and what it looks like. There you go. Also, filling up holes is important, and putting down torches is also important. Once again, have the uh, thirst issue. We definitely need this canteen at some point. So it's kind of important. So we're gonna have to just give ourselves thirst. Respawn when the 
as she has seeds, she'll be happy to trade for them. Wow, okay, that's fantastic news, thank you very much, Madame Goddess. Oh look, wow, oh that's fantastic, so literally, this building, this is the Carpenter Blueprint specifically, and it'll just build wherever we want to put it. <laughs> that's absolutely incredible, okay. Well, I haven't decided exactly where that's going to be built just yet, but I do know that what I want to do is make ourselves a road and how that's going to work, I guess, will be an interesting thing that we'll have to decide next time. there means that the wall lines up with the back of this house. Now, this isn't going to be per se the, the correct set out for every single building that we make, because the other buildings will be built in some kind of a town where 
absolutely incredible. Little Yusuf doing his job. It does mean that we'll have to make a new place for the goddess to come in every time, but that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Oh, fantastic. Well, I guess that means that we'll talk to Jade when she joins us on the next episode. Next time. soon. Sweet dreams, everyone.